Nate and I are back on one of our favorite lakes today. Let's see how it treats us. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy. And today after fishing with Robbie Jarnigo from today's angler for a couple days, Nate and I are back on our own fishing one of our favorite lakes up here. Uh, it's been good to us over the years, um, but we have had some off days out here too. So let's keep our fingers crossed that this is one of the good ones. We've got 70 to 72 degree water temps, uh, mix of clouds and sun. We've got a little bit of a breeze. So. Uh, and coming into the new moon in a couple days. So we should have good conditions, fish should be moving. Let's just hope that we can keep a few of them pinned so we can get a look at them. All right, everybody, it is Northwoods, Wisconsin. You know what that means, killer corn, Esox Assault, EA8. This is an old war horse, so she's been beat up, but I have confidence she can still get us a fish. 2020 Assault Stick, Surgical Strike, Tranks 400, you know the deal. Nate's throwing a 10 inch Navin that currently has a couple of weeds on it because we're fishing some weed beds, but He's, uh, what are you throwing that on? SWAT? Surgical strike. Oh, oh surgical strike, yeah. okay. So 10 inch nav and surgical strike. Yeah, 20, 20 rods, so it's the thing, people. All right, let's catch fish. Just came off. Did it really? Did you get a look at it? I mean, just out there. I mean, it was decent. Yeah. Yeah. The route has been over pretty I good. I know. Dude. <laughs> I just saw it flashing, but when I was digging for the net. Wow. That almost happened there, folks. That's pretty sad. Oh, what a bummer. All right, well, a couple unfortunate things happened there. I lost what seems to be a nice fish on this Medusa, mid Medusa, I got a little deep threat weight to get it down there, one ounce. Uh, and I don't think my chest cam was working, so you might just be seeing me fumble around in front of the boat and not have any really good audio, but uh, we shall see. I guess we'll never know until we go back and look at the footage. But that, I think, was a nice fish. Um, found a nice edge with some rocks on it, and just before it hit some weeds, that fish hit. So. Um, I'm trying to be positive and not be too mad about this, but I guess all you can do is just keep casting. So that was fun. Fish, 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 nice fish, nice fish. He's off. Gah! Oh. So done right now. <laughs> so done. That looked pretty good. How big do you think it was? Low 40s. Yeah. He wet, he was swatting at it. I, I thought it was bouncing off weeds. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Okay, here's where we're at. I'm so close to pulling the plug on the boat, putting it in the center of the lake, and then swimming to shore and just leaving everything here. It's not even funny. That's how today's going. Lost a big fish on a Medusa. Chest cam wasn't working, so that's probably gonna be terrible. Nate had a follow. Chest cam wasn't working. That will probably also be terrible, so my apologies for crummy audio. And then, for the trifecta, I finally hook a fish on a bucktail, and it gets off. That's today. It's fantastic. Mm. Swedes, maybe. Well, that's cool. I cannot catch a break. <clears throat> Hit right where it should. Yeah. I mean, at least that was a small one. Again, Brian, those are the kind of positives that we get anymore. Wow. I mean, the sharp edge I can see is on the inside, but there's definitely some shenanigans going on around here. Oh yeah. There's fish, there's fish. She took off. Oh no! They're supposed to come back. There's a little bit of weed on there, but... Oh, came up top corner, looked at it, and then took off. Okay, well... How big was it? Uh, you know, it was one of those mid-upper 30s. It was a decent fish. Arr. fish running out of time to make up for the first part of the day. Well, folks, I don't know what to say about that other than that was exquisitely frustrating. That encapsulates 
how absolutely frustrating <laughs> musky fishing can be. I'm at a loss for words, I guess. Um, yeah, that that really sucked. We went from really being close to a three fish day with two of them being really nice to Zippo. And uh, that's just really unfortunate. So before the mosquitoes try to carry us away, we need to get back. We've got about a 40 minute ride back to the cabin. Uh, we need to get some food and I don't know, all you can do is just hope tomorrow's gonna be better. So that's what we're gonna do. Thanks for watching everybody. We're gonna try to do better for you next time and put a fish in the boat. I uh, appreciate all you guys watching. We'll see you on the next video. Come on. Come on. Come on.